All right, I thought I'd show off some of my work on my voxel editor here. So I've gone and expanded my voxel engine a little bit, rewritten the picking algorithm so I can assign priorities to different things that are pickable. And here we go, I've got a grid here that's 16 by 16, which is showing off a bit of a voxel chunk. And I can go and move my mouse over it. It has the picking algorithm running, it lets me know on the 2D surface where I'm clicking. And I can go and place a voxel down. And I can go place a bunch of voxels down and we can see do the optimization in wireframe mode. So we'll kick over into wireframe mode just so you can see. So we're not using too many triangles. And I can also go and select a different color and go start to write with that. Let's see here. Make sure we grab that. So not too bad. And it optimizes uh, each of the colors separately. So you'll see as I go and start to drop this color in here to avoid any issues with over optimizing or optimizing on faces it shouldn't have it actually goes and optimizes the color separately so I think that's the best approach at least for now so we can go and drop a few more things in here it's a pretty quick alg algorithm to run so we're building something up, place a few different colors in And we can see how this could very quickly become, oh my goodness, a pretty decent little editor. So that's the structure I built up there. Oh man. Anyways, yeah, um, that's really about it. I've got a little bit of a third person camera I wrote, and soon I'm going to have to write an actual color picker where you can see all the 256 different colors I support. Right now I'm just using a byte to store the voxel information, but I could conceivably punch that up to 16 bits or even 32 bits so we have more color range. I just chose a byte because I was being silly and wanted to save space, but modern computers have tons of RAM so it's probably not an issue. Anyways, yep, that's about it for now, so stay tuned for more in the future. Hopefully I'll have this editor up and running by the end of tonight and be able to send it out to a few of my friends so we can try out some voxel art. So take care and happy coding.